Alright guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. As you guys can see, I am back on Pokemon Go again. But basically, I'm just going to be talking about it, really. Uh, I won't really going to say anything. But, um, so basically, I am going to be talking about all the events right now that's in Pokemon Go. And especially the last event that just ended. And then the other before that. So we have our Jono. The Jono Restart. The Throwback Challenge 2020 Restart. I have completed some of this. I'm not. I'm, I'm not fully done with it yet, but I will be done as soon as the uh, Ice Togo is back up. But anyway, this is my second account. I'm not gonna mess with it uh, at this moment. We did have uh, Snubble restart, and it's over with also. So and I ended up getting this many times. I evolved two of them, so this is one of them. I got this one. This is the first one that I got. It was actually a pretty good shiny. Then I ended up getting this one. This is a, a good shiny as well. But a bad GP. Then this one I evolved from a 5 or 4 something. I don't remember. Uh, this is Grand Bulls uh, form. Uh, there is no other form that I think of. <clears throat> but anyway, here's the next one, which is the same one I evolved earlier period early today. So and I did catch it yesterday. So anyway, today Sorry about that guys. But anyway, today it is Mother's Day. I've always said happy Mother's Day to her mom. And I will be explaining a little bit more in here in a little bit. Why I'm not caught, I'm going to be telling it to my mom. Why I'm not said mine yet. So there is going to be certain points. So, and we also have Garantina back in raid. So, he is back in raid for another two, a week or two. And, yeah, and it can be shiny still. So, then we got Skarmory. Back and rise for this event, also the general event. This is pretty good. And you guys can wonder, I did get me a, a computer stand, so I'll let you guys know. I got a computer stand. If you guys can see, I got the wall over here, I got the printer over here, and TV and everything. She's over there watching her movie, so I'm gonna put this stand. So she is watching her movie. Um, so basically, then we have the Umbreon Hat Pikachu. So I'll show you guys this. It's this one Umbreon Hat Pikachu. And it's out. I did get able, oh, uh, I was able to get the Charizard Pikachu, but not the Sunny. That's not it. Right. This one. This one was the first one that came out for the. Kanto throwback effect and when the shiny internet was released. I didn't get a chance to do that, to do that. But I did get a chance to do this event and I did end up getting a shiny Dunk Spark. But not in this account, but on another one. So I was over a fight. Yeah, it's really pretty good, but wasn't that mad. So anyway, that's gonna be the end of the video today guys. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment down below what we're gonna do next. See you guys later. Have a Mother's Day. Alrighty, guys, what's up? Welcome back. I gotta clear it. Let me get this little underwear. It does it sometimes. I don't see me. It's a little fuzzy, but it's gonna be up for that. Okay. Alright guys, so basically, I'm going to be talking about Mother's Day, and I really see, tell you guys the reasons why I'm not saying Mother's Day to my mom. So basically, uh, my reasons are, my mom kicked us out, so I'm going to be talking about that right now. So, basically what happened is, she got her stimulus back, my fiance got her stimulus, and uh, she uh, went to go with Walmart, well, what? get some stuff, but before we went to Walmart, we went to Cricket and got me the new phone, the new uh, Samsung A10e, and it ended up 
almost a brawl because she called and told us not to spend all the money. So we didn't. And next thing we did, we went to Walmart just to get a few things, and we ended up getting bit there. And we got a phone call, and she told us that she's kicking us out. Man, this camera's got blur all over it. Okay. Then she, uh, then she kicked us out basically over her stimulus. And I just, I'm just not understand why she did that. I'm not understand why. It's her money. Like, she's getting a second round of it. She's, uh, hold up. She's getting a second round of it, you guys. And I don't understand what her deal is, man. I mean, she has lost her, her fucking mind. I don't know. And all she wants is fucking privacy. And, like, she's wanting her boyfriend's dick. Like, like, are you serious? Like, you don't care about your own son? Like, what the fuck? To try to, uh, to attack my fiance by yelling at her. And then she tried, and then she attacked me by going her arm and hit me in the back like that. And, uh, after that, I have said, you know what? You're not my mom. You're not, no bit of it. Yeah, you're being removed out of my life. I'm not even going to say nothing to you. And I'm not going to call you. And if you call me, I'm going to hang on you. And that's what I'm doing. I have not called her. I blocked her. She's not allowed to call my phone. She's not, she, just basically, she's nothing but a bitch. Because my dad, when they were together back in 2000, uh, they, uh, I, uh, ran off. I'll tell you guys a story. I was, there's a bed that was right here, uh, right in front of us. Uh, it was thrown in the trash a while, about a couple of years ago because it was no good. And, uh, so, hold on a second, guys. I gotta do something. Well, I can't remember anything. But anyway, as I was saying, um, all I'm trying to say is she doesn't wouldn't let us borrow cigarettes off her. She wouldn't, uh, just about, uh, just about anything. She would refuse to help us. She would refuse to do anything for us. And, and she, and my fiance put food in the damn house, like, like, oh, a hundred dollars. Like close to two hundred, and I I don't understand like what is her deal is, but I'm getting to the point where I'm throwing certain people out of my life if they're gonna fucking be goddamn rude and be a bitch to me, like then throw me out like what the fuck did I do? Like I'm not even doing anything, guys, and she just did it for no reason. Um, I don't know. She. Basically, she's lost her mind. And after her dog passed away, and I posted that on YouTube the same day she passed away, she started to flip on me. And I don't know why. It's fucking crazy to even think about it and even talk to her without having her bitch. She's not even apologized to her. She hasn't done nothing. She hasn't even called and said, oh, I'm sorry, da, 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 da. she's not done any of that, and I don't know why, and basically, she's lost her fucking mind, and she's nothing to me anymore, I've already told her that, as I told her, she is none of moms anymore, I've got a stepmom that will take care of me even more than you will, that's what I told her. And then she didn't worry about her toes, and it turned into a whelp. She ended up getting, giving her lotion that didn't even work. Like, one bottle of it didn't even work. The other two did, but the other one didn't. I don't understand it, you guys, but all I'm saying is right now, um, you guys up there will understand the issue with my mom. If you ever live with her or talk to her or whatever. But... I just don't understand her, man. She's not, she's not normal. She has not, hasn't been for the last couple of years. She hasn't been normal. 
And plus, she hasn't been normal since her dog passed away. That was her mom's. That was my grandma's. But I, I just, I just don't get it. Like, I don't know. I don't see what her issue is. I don't see what her deal is. You know, and I take shit seriously. I do, and I mean it too. I'm a half, uh, half mean bitch to an half nice bitch, which means I'm half fuck you, and then I'm half okay, we're good, like same way. But I don't know. So I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and comment down below when we do next. And I'll see you guys later. Peace. Happy Mother's Day.